Hey guys, how's it going on? Today in this video, I will talk about a retina display. I'm just going to explain to you guys what a retina display is. The retina display is actually a brand name used by Apple for displays claimed to have a pixel density so high that it, the eye would not be able to distinguish between uh, the pixelation at a typical viewing distance. Now, a retina display can be found on iPad 3, iPod Touch, 4G, iPhone 4, iPhone 4S, and also now the next generation MacBook Pros. Now, let me give you some numbers as well. The iPhone and the iPod Touch has a resolution of 960 by 640 with the PPI of 326. The iPad 3 has a resolution of uh, 2048 by 1536 with a PPI of 264. And the MacBook Pro has a resolution of 2880 by 1800 with a PPI of 220. Now you guys might be saying what is PPI? Well PPI is actually how many pixels are there in one square inch of a screen or of a display actually. Now Apple claims the display is a true retina display which has a PPI of more than 300 meaning there are more than 300 pixels in one inch of a device in one square inch of a device with a viewing distance of about 10 or 10 inches or less. Now if you guys remember those numbers which I told, um, you guys can then say that the iPhone has the best display with pixel density of 300. Well, that's not quite right because viewing distance is just as important as the PPI itself. So guys, the larger the viewing distance, the lesser the pixels we need. So, be, uh, so basically, when we are using a MacBook Pro, you know, we will be actually using it from a distance of about 12 to 18, maybe about uh you can say 20 24 inches so you know with that sort of a viewing distance we need lesser pixels and we would still not be able to distinguish uh between pixels so that is basically what retina display is now if you guys actually uh this is actually a pretty nice formula which was uh, done by logically hank and that was that he multiplied the number of pixels or ppi and then actually multiply that with the uh, with the total viewing distance and so as you guys can see this multiplication uh, and this formula that is right there you guys can see that the pixel clarity is a lot more uh, on the macbook pro uh, than on the ipad or on the iphone 4s so uh, just like this you guys can see that the macbook pro's retina display is actually quite good and it's just that the ppr doesn't matter it's also the um, other things the viewing distance so guys that's it from this video i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will be doing these sort of videos more so just hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel share this video and i will catch you guys pretty soon bye bye